Why do we sleep? We know everyone does it, from you and me to fish, birds, and bees. But answering this question is more complex than it seems at first. So let's start by answering, what is sleep? We know it's composed of cycles of roughly 90 minutes, 80 minutes of non-REM sleep, or non-rapid eye movement sleep, and 10 minutes of REM sleep, during which most people dream. The average adult needs 8 hours of sleep, young adults need closer to 9, and little children sleep much, much longer. But still, why do we need it? There have been several reasons suggested in the past. To conserve energy, avoid predators, repair the body, grow the brain. But none of these theories had the empirical data to back them up. However, sleep is obviously necessary for both the brain and the body. The latest research illustrates that sleep seems to be critical in three domains learning and memory, emotional stability, and creativity. First, sleep may help you remember things better, from when the Roman Empire fell to how to shoot a free throw. It may also help you stay emotionally stable and calm in the face of stress. And finally, it seems that sleep helps foster insight and creativity. In fact, some of humanity's greatest accomplishments come from dreaming, from Mendeleev's periodic table to the tune of the Beatles' hit song, Yesterday. Yesterday Sleep deprivation has strong impacts on the body as well, specifically the immune and metabolic systems. Antibodies are slower, natural killer cells are less active, glucose doesn't get metabolized at a normal rate, and hormones become greatly imbalanced. To make things worse, sleep deprivation is also linked to poorer attention and perhaps even long-term mental health problems. In fact, as measured by driving ability, being sleep deprived for 22 hours is equivalent to being drunk enough to qualify for a DUI. For all these reasons, we need our rest. So sleep tight, sleep well, and it might just make you a better person.